Hey, what's up YouTube? So, after three days of Googling, you decided to finally do it. What? Flash your latest and greatest ROM to your phone. But guess what? As you figured, it went horribly wrong. And now you can't tell if your phone is hard brick or soft brick. So in this video, we take a look at how to tell if your phone is hard brick or soft brick and how to fix it. Okay, first way to start fixing it is to determine which one you have. So let's see. A soft break is usually when the phone is stuck in a boot loop caused normally by a software error or bug that stops the phone from doing a normal system boot. Now what's a hard break? A hard break is when the phone does not boot at all and sometimes shows no indication of life whatsoever. Mean even if you put, plug it in, it does not light up or boot up or shows any sign of life. That's a hard break. So what causes a phone to be soft break? Simply, software errors. That could mean a lot of things. When you're installing a new RAM, you probably made a mistake or probably that the RAM was corrupted could be any numerous issues, any number of issues actually that causes a soft break. But they're normally glitches and minor software issues. What normally causes a phone to be hard break is stuff like unplugging from Odin and don't do that. Don't unplug from Odin before you're finished flashing your RAM. Next Flashing the wrong version of the ROM for your phone. If you're not sure what version of the ROM should go on your phone or what's the ROM version overall or serial number, just leave it alone, stick with stock. And flashing a corrupted ROM. I'm not sure why you would do it, but be careful where you download your ROMs from because getting a corrupted ROM can really mess up your phone. And I mean mess up your phone. And Last but not least, messing around with stuff in Odin that you have no clue about. If you have no clue about it, don't touch it. Watch a YouTube video, find out what it is before you try to flash it. Because that is what will normally lead to a hard brick phone. How to fix? Alright, how to fix a soft brick phone? Soft brick fixes are easy. All you need to do is remove the corrupted software that can either be wiped or just restored or just do a factory reset or either through recovery mode or download mode. Just enter recovery mode or enter download mode and install the software again or simply wipe the software from your phone and just simply reinstall another software and that should fix it because all it is is a glitch. There are a few fixes for a hard brick phone. You only have two main options because hard bricks are very, if not near impossible to recover from. So you only have two options. First, to get a USB jig. The USB jigs can be purchased online. That's the first stop. You try to use your USB jig and try to see if you can recover the phone to get it into download or recovery mode. If that doesn't work, there's only one other available option, and that is to get it JTAG. You have to get a JTAG service, and that can be quite costly. So you'll have to think about if you really do want this phone or need this phone, or you probably be better served buying a new one. So there you have it. Only two so um, solutions for a hard brick phone. Either getting a USB jig, First, and if that doesn't work, then paying for a JTAG service. And those are the only two known fixes for a hard brick phone. If you enjoyed this video and you have any questions at all, leave them in the comment section below. I'll try my best to answer them once I have the time. 
and if you enjoy just give it a thumbs up and tell me how much you like it and thanks thanks guys for watching it's been great